hi guys welcome to my channel guys today in this video I am going to show you that how you can make this beautiful contact us page by using simple bootstrap and CSS so first of all here we have our contact us heading with the box shadow and after that we have our first input section with the first name and we have to add our first name and after that we have our another input section with the border effect whenever we hover on this input section it's uh, make the border effect and after that we have to put our gmail our email the next section is input section and after that we have to uh, uh, we have to put our message right here i'm writing please subscribe to my channel and guys if you are new to my channel then please subscribe to our channel and after that we have one uh, checkbox that i am not a robot and after on the la right side on the right side we have one button so okay guys let's get started uh, guys uh, first of all here we have one html file and one css file and we have one background image so guys uh, starting with the bootstrap we have to copy the bootstrap template from get bootstrap website copy this started template from this website and paste it in your html file just remove this unwanted content and start making the contact us page so okay guys here are CSS file I am taking the universal tags padding 0 margin 0 and box sizing is border box so okay let me link this CSS file in our HTML file okay guys let's start the let's start to let's start building this contact us page first of all I am taking one section with the class of contact and after that I am taking one container and inside this container I am taking one row and inside this row I am taking six column and after that I am taking one card and the card body let me see uh, so this is we have to design the first header section for that I am taking one row and the 12 columns here I am taking the head class and inside this head I am taking the h3 heading contact us Uh, the text will be centered and the text color will be white so here I am uh, adding some CSS for this heading part and the contact us uh, class I am taking the background image with the no repetition and the background size is uh, cover or 100 percent and the width will be 100 percent and the height will be 100 vh and after that i am going to design our head this one first of all the background color will be this dark magenta and the border radius will be 5 pixels And now let me add some padding top and bottom so now let me see the output so this is our output it is uh, let me add some padding top and bottom to this container and we want this card in the center so we need to uh, add some margin uh, left and right is auto so this card will be centered so this is our output and now let me change the background color of this head uh, the margin top we need the margin top minus 40 pixel so this is the same let me add that uh, box shadow for this header part this is the CSS box shadow generator website 
you can make uh, you can redesign any type of box shadow for your uh, website for any of your section just paste uh, this right over here so now let me see the output so you can see this box shadow on this header part and after that we are going to design this input section so after this row here I am taking uh, one more row uh, the form and inside this form I am taking one form row and inside this form row I am taking six columns and one input section with the class of uh, effect one and after that the placeholder enter your first name And after this input section I am taking one span tag with the class of focus button and this is our one input section and let me copy this six columns uh, one more time to get the another input section so let's change this first name with the last name and let me see the output so here you can see there is no padding between this header part and this input section so after that let me add some padding top and bottom between this heading section and this form and the margin top and bottom is 5 So now let me see the output so this is our output this is the output without any animation without any uh, focus effect on this input section let me design first of all this form then we will add some css on this form and after that uh, after this form row i am taking one more form row for the email section with the 12 columns let me copy this input section and paste it right over here and just change the placeholder with the email address let me see the output After this form row, I am taking one more form row for the message section for the text area. For that, first of all, I am taking 12 columns, and inside this 12 columns, I am going to paste our this input section with the placeholder of message. Let me change this placeholder. your message and let me add some padding top 5 and padding bottom is always for and also 5 4 so here is the output here is our form with the input sections and now let me take one more row for the button and the for checks box this is our form row and I am taking 6 column for the checkbox. First of all I am taking the P tag. Inside this P tag I am taking one input section with the type of checkbox.
the paragraph will be I am not a robot. And after this uh, column, let me take four more columns with the class of offset to the two columns will be off and the four column will be used and inside this four columns I am taking one button with a class of btn1 so we will design this btn1 one class in our CSS send message so now let me see the output so here is our output now let me uh, add some CSS for this we are going to add some padding top 4 between this row and the, the top one row so here is the output so now let me add some CSS for all these input sections first of all I am taking this effect 1 class first of all I am taking this effect 1 class let me add border 0 and the outline will be none and the width will be 100% and the padding top and bottom will be 7 pixel and left and right will be 0 and border bottom will be uh, 1 pixel solid this color and after that uh, we have to add some focus effect on this class on this input section the focus border uh, are this spam class and now let me add some CSS for the position will be absolute and the bottom is 0 and the left will be 50 pigs 50% 50 and width will be 0 and the height will be 2 pixel and the background color that we used for the header part Let me copy this background color and the transition uh, will be 0 0.4 seconds so now let me copy this effect one class and add some focus uh, on the input sections So now if you see the output but we are focusing on this input section but we are not getting our uh, the transition effect and uh, the animation effect on this input section with the border. So here is one uh, mistakes. Uh, the mistake is uh, the last uh, section the effect one whenever we focus on this uh, focus border here we put two dots the effect one class before the effect one class we put two dots so let me see so let me remove this one dot from here and now let me see the output so this is our output whenever we focus on this input sections it's create the border effect and now we are going to design our btn1 first of all i am taking the background color that we used uh, before for this effect one plus 
and the color will be white of the text and the outline will be none and the border will be none and the border radius will be 5 pixels and the height will be 40 pixels and the width will be 145 pixel so now let me see the output so there here is our button and now let me add some hover effect on this button whenever we hover on this button it's create the shadow effect so let me copy this shadow and put it right over here now let me see whenever we hover on this button it's create the shadow effect so this is all uh, for now guys if you like this video then please uh, subscribe to our channel